Hey guys, it's uh, Levi here. Uh, I just finished The Walking Dead. Me and Adam uh, just spent uh, the last about hour and a half, hour and 45 minutes uh, just, you know, seeing the ending, seeing how it all transpires. And, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm just... I'm just full of emotion right now. I mean, I'm happy. See, I've got smile on my face. But I'm sad. I'm angry. I'm just. I love that game. Like, I've been playing it. <clears throat> I've been. I bought the first episode back in early summer, and I've just. We've just been. Me and Adam have just been. Just like pounding it out. Every episode that comes out, we we've, we've been playing it. We talk about it for a good week or so after the episode, and we wait. And, you know, because it's great. It's like it's it's a TV show that you kind of play it a little bit, but it, it's like a comic book TV show. It's hard to explain, but it's like the story is so it's amazing. And um, I I haven't I don't think I've ever played a game when I've developed such a um, just a bond with the characters because you know I mean like I like to just first off I like to I love to give a shout out to Lee. And to my to my girl Clementine. I mean, I don't I don't know if I can. I want to give some spoilers. I want to say a few things. Lee, you're a trooper. Clementine, you're a trooper. They're just both troopers. I mean, Ben, you're a trooper. I mean, you're. Oh, I just love the game. Like, I'm gonna replay it. I'm gonna replay it all. I'm gonna try to do different things. I've I've always been an RPG fan, and Telltale, you guys took this to the max. Um, I can't wait to see what you guys do in later games. Um. If it's with the Walking Dead series, or if it's not, because either way, I'm 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 with you guys to the end now, because you really, you really just hit the you hit a home run, and um, you guys did an amazing job. So um, I I I just I'd love to just say if you guys if you've never played the game, just go out and buy a copy, or not buy a copy, but go out buy some Microsoft points, buy some micros, and um, play the first episode, see how it goes. It's only 400 Microsoft points. It's it's worth you while five dollars it's um it's in it, it's an experience it really is like it's a journey um and uh if you get you get to the final end of the journey i don't think you'll come empty-handed because i feel right there in my heart i feel i feel a, a development with the characters you ask adam he'll say the same thing you know if i if i wasn't in a party with with adam and a couple of other buds i really think i would have been crying i don't like I was a little bit lighthearted, but if I was sit, I was sitting there, it was just me sitting in the dark, just thinking about it. I think I might have burst out crying a couple times because that some brutal moments, some story, some like st masterful storytelling, and um, you know, if you've never, even if you don't even know anything about the show, I mean, I've watched the first season of the show, I never really got that far in the show, but the it's the same universe, it's different um characters. It's it's a, it's a journey I must say, and um <clears throat> I'd like to also touch on this is my second point um um after after I'm done here I'm gonna sit sit back and watch a little bit of that 70s show because I I'm I'm an avid Netflix user and um I've been uh, watching that 70s show and I've just been uh past month or so I've been watching every single episode since since episode or since episode one season one I've just been watching it. And um, you know, I've always watched it. I've I've always loved it. You know, after school, I'd come home, turn on ABC Family, be on for a couple hours. But you know how sitcoms are. You can just pick it up, watch it. You don't really have to. You don't really have to watch it episode one after episode two. You don't have to develop. You don't have to watch it every single one throughout. But um, I said, you know, I love this show. I I'm probably not giving it what it deserves. Um, so I decided I was just going to start watching it from fully and um I've been watching it I, I really I I don't know it's kind of it's kind of a walking dead thing the same with it like it's it's a hilarious show but I've um I don't know what I'm gonna do when it's over like I watch it every night about every night and I tweet about it I'm just I'm just I'm hooked you know everything that happens I just I love it you know so right now I'm at the the start of season eight and um well, the end of season seven. I have not started season eight. Eric's going to Africa. You know, some people. That's a big topic of discussion. I know it's happened in two thousand four, but people still have feelings about that. They say the show is no good without Eric. But you know, in my opinion, it's okay. It's a good story piece. It makes sense. 
So you know what? They wrote him out for a season. I understand. I do understand, but um, it's kind of, that show reminds me a lot about Parks and Rec, Parks and Recreation. You know, I mean, like Parks and Rec. Every character, there's about seven or eight main characters. Every single main character is hilarious. Same thing with that seventy show. I mean, that's why I don't mind seeing um Eric leave because it's not like the show is resting upon his like scrawny shoulders. You know, <laughs> like he he did make the show partially, but you know everyone like you got Red, freaking my favorite dude. Red is my favorite guy. Um. Shout out to Adam Taylor's dad, because Adam Taylor's dad, um, Barracks Panda, that is red. He is red. Um, I don't care what anybody says. You got Kitty. I mean, I'm not just going to see your name characters, but, I mean, Fez is hilarious, obviously. Like, Kelso's an idiot, but he just, everything about the show. So I don't mind seeing him go. Um, but when it's over, I'm going to, I'm probably going to cry, because I've already developed, um, the last ditch strategy. When it's over, um, which it will, the impending doom is going to happen, but um, I'm going to watch uh, How I Met Your Mother, and it's the same thing. I used to watch it a little bit here and there, but I've never devoted my time to it completely, and I'm I'm going to I'm going to go through it, and um, you'll see me be talking about it. If it's if it's if it's as good as I remember, I will be, I'll be talking about it. I'll I'll ask you guys what you think about it. I know we don't have that many subscribers now, but I mean, if you guys want to keep in touch with what I'm doing, um. I'll tell you guys when I start watching it. If you guys have Netflix, you, you can start watching it too. We can talk about it if you've already watched them. We can, you know, we can chit chat a little bit about it because, um, you know, it's always fun. Small talk is always fun, especially when it's about uh, TV shows and, and whatnot. Because uh, I know some of the guys in this channel, they're not, you know, they want to talk about games. But, you know, I'm not the biggest gamer. I love I love playing video games with my friends, but um, I'm not. It's not all about video games. I got a lot. I mean, I I read a lot. I listen to a lot of music. I mean, I like to um I like to do a lot of different stuff. So you you guys want to know um you guys want to talk to me about certain things? It's uh you know diverts from the gaming uh, road. You know I'm here and um um I think that we're good. Uh, like Adam Taylor said, stay crispy, everybody. And um I know Thanksgiving's over, but I'm thankful for I'm thankful for you guys watching this right now. I hope that um. I hope that uh, you guys uh, are thankful for me. I just, um, I just hope you guys have a great night and uh, you know stay golden, everybody.